we are at Pipeline. Today is supposed to be the biggest day of the swell. It's gonna be picking up all day. Um, but it's weird, it's got this suit, it's kind of early, it's got this morning sickness on it, so it's like all cloudy, kind of windy and choppy. But a lot of times, what all it has to do is just the sun has to come out and burn off all the bad stuff, I like to think. But we're gonna probably just go get a quick session in down there with the boys and then come back to pipe and hopefully it's got some waves in a little bit so we'll see winter is starting you can see there's some sets coming out there it looks there's energy in the water for sure Rah, we're, look at this wave Radical. are you kidding tree me? right in right in uh, <laughs> oh you can't see i can see it in the back yeah Bruh, it's draining Spare. yeah <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. That is the craziest ramp I've ever look seen. Like, look like Tube City on the inside. Beretta. <laughs> oh, Beretta. Okay, I will for sure. So you guys do. What board are you taking out? Taking out the 28 liter because I really like it. Yeah. It could be really fun. I had a great time on my little 510 shortboard. I probably could have used like a 6.4 to do some big carves, but the current was just ripping non-stop down away, out to sea. I just found this in the shore break and throw it away because it's a piece of plastic that's gonna break down into little pieces and probably kill a sea creature. So, oh, I don't know, I'm exhausted. That was nuts. How long was that, like two hours? It was like a two hour session. Me and Eli just paddled in current the whole time. It was actually really fun. Especially while nowhere else was good. That was great. All right, wait, I just want to tell you guys about a wave I had out there. When I'm out there just in the current, trying to battle it, and all of a sudden a wave comes, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna go. I look back and my friend Cole Christensen looks like he's going but doesn't get in. And then I'm like in the wave. All of a sudden I look back, he's standing up coming down the line. And I tried to pull out the back and just hit water, hit a little like double up whitewash, and then just went over the falls onto them, almost. It was nuts. I was like the biggest kook ever. Like, oh, I'm not going, sucked over. <laughs> Pretty funny. All right, let's go. Oh, reusable bottles. If you guys make it to North Shore, gotta come check out Poopa Kia Grill. This is a spot. Thank you so much. They called it in. I want that one though. Yeah. Oh my god. I don't know if we have enough food. <laughs> Hungry. I'm not surfing after this. Yeah, we are. There will be no surfing after this for quite some time. Huey. <laughs> This is actually Jack's Aussie. Well, I'm gonna try it. Though. You guys thought this was a surf vlog? 
This is a food tour. The North Shore food tour. Oh my oh gosh. Man. I mean, if you guys are on North Shore, you guys gotta come check it out. It's amazing. Mm. Best food ever. <laughs> I think I overshot the landing with the no sunscreen in my last session. I'm pretty roasted back there, but I got my rash guard to keep me protected in the second session here. I got a little tip for you guys. If you guys are just starting to surf or whatever, here's a tip. You want to make sure your leash is always a little bit longer than your surfboard. For some reason that makes it so your board doesn't fly back at you when you fall and the board's underwater. It helps a lot. So your leash has always got to be longer than your surfboard. Huh? Hey. Oh my god, he's going for it. Well, Rockies is maxing size right now. And we're gonna pal out and hopefully get some sick sections. Pipe is no good. I can see it's washing through, but it's just, there's too much sand and it's, it's aching. No good. So we're gonna go out here. That was a horrible session. Definitely could have done without that session. Stuck in current the whole time. Wind and salt water just blowing straight into my eyes and then it started raining. And that was blowing just directly into my eyes. It felt like little needles. Awful. I'm calling it a day. Two beat from the past few days. It's been a good first swell, that's for sure. Thank you guys for watching the videos. If you guys could like this video, subscribe to my channel. That would be amazing. Also, go check out my blenders, signature shades. The link will be in this bio. The link will be in the bio of this video. Click it, get yourself a pair of This Is Living Shades. Thank you all for the support. This is what, day four of the swell now and Rockies is still pumping. I'm gonna go out with the squad again. My skin is burning from yesterday. That sunburn I got was not healthy at all. So I got this little top on to hopefully not get sunburned today. But I checked pipe earlier to see what the sand was doing and it looks like it's moving quick so hopefully by the end of this swell, the next swell coming, we will have some pipe sessions on the way. Super possible. It's starting early. I can see waves down there right now still just pushing sand down. That's what we need. So. Soon enough, we'll be out there. For now, I go surf out here. And you can dance. For inspiration. Come on.
shit, that hurt so bad. Do you see what happened? Yeah, I just saw it from behind. He hit the lip. Did you see it break? I couldn't tell. Broke in between my legs when I went up to do a turn. See that? And then went straight into my balls. That was so gnarly. I think PK has a good clip of it. The surfboard is so good. Of course, I just break my favorite surfboard of all time. But it's okay. I just grabbed some water and some food and I'm headed back out on pretty much the same exact surfboard, just one liter bigger. But I'm ready to rip. I know exactly what I need to do. I need to get out there and just relax. Surf with the wave. Flow with the ocean. <laughs> Big backside turns, that's all I wanna do. I feel like I'm gonna hurt myself if I stay on the lefts and keep trying to hit those silly sections. Oh, the fin did it. It actually did it. It's on free spool. See that? It's just a never ending spin. But the fin's locked in, so it's all good. Let's go back out, Ivan. This is, it's gonna start dropping from here on out. Then we must wait for the next swell, which could be the last swell. Good too. It feels amazing. I figured out these fins John gave me, they're like these weird prototypes. I don't even know what they're called. But I noticed that it does not work if my foot's up here in any way, my back foot. If I put it all the way against this pad, it works so good. And I love it. And I love this board. I'm glad I got it because I just snapped my other one. That was a fun, quick little session. It looks like another massive rain squall is coming through dropping a little bit so I'm gonna go grab some food and then see what the rest of the day brings. Just gotta go with the flow man. Go with the flow. For inspiration. Come on. Come on. Come on.